Belbian architectural finishes must be applied to a completely smooth, non-porous substrate. Prior to applying Belbian, make sure your surface is smooth. If your surface is rough or has any imperfections, be sure to sand them down and then clean the surface with isopropyl alcohol before installing the Belbian. Prior to applying Belbian to your surface, be sure to apply the adhesive promoter to your substrate. The adhesive promoter only needs to be applied to plane changes, complex curves, and where the material ends. Pre-cut Belbian to fit the entire drawer face. Make sure you leave enough material to also wrap the sides. Utilize overlapping squeegee strokes to ensure you do not miss any areas when adhering the Belbian to the surface. Before wrapping the sides of the drawer face, you'll want to utilize a relief cut at all four corners. Cut the material out from the corner and then begin wrapping the sides. After all four relief cuts have been performed, you're going to want to wrap the sides one by one. The first side should be wrapped slowly, starting from the 90 degree turn down. Once the side is wrapped, you'll want to cut off your excess material from the corner and then move on to the next side. Anywhere Belbian ends is considered an exposed edge. Be sure to cut any exposed edges holding the knife at a 45 degree angle. This will bevel the edge and will help prevent peeling. Be sure to utilize a sanding block to properly finish the edges. Any edge that was cut at a 45 degree angle can now be further beveled with a sanding block. Make sure you only sand away from the material as sanding back and forth can peel the material back up. We appreciate you taking the time to properly learn how to install Belbian architectural finishes. If you have any more questions, please contact us. All of our company information will be found at the end of this video.